Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So, I have been waiting to make this video for a very long time. Uh, ever since Apocalypse came out, and I found out about his ability to make horsemen, I wanted to make this video. Alright, so, uh, we're gonna go into Realm of Legends, and what we're gonna do is we're going to make a horseman. And we're going to use one of the synergies to make a horseman rather quickly and easily. And I will show you what I mean there. All right. But I'm just showing you the synergies that we have active. Uh, there might be better synergies uh, for him, like maybe crit damage synergies and things like that. But this is what I went in with uh, for this time. All right. So what we're going to do. If you watched my video on Apocalypse, you know about that synergy he has with Cable. All right, so you see how he went in with one persistent charge. All right, now he's got four persistent charges because of the synergy with Cable. And you'll see I quit right away because I'm not trying to do that fight with him. Now, you cannot use your pre-fight when he's knocked out. So that means I have to do a revive. This is something that you can also do during your questing. And if he's awakened, you'll actually heal him all the way back up, save some health potions, all right? But we go to the pre-fight, we uh, go ahead and activated it. Now we go into the fight with Wolverine and look to the left uh, and you'll see that he is now a horseman, okay, of Apocalypse. See that icon up uh, in the left there, all the way to the left. Now look at his damage, okay? So, as a horseman, and he has a synergy with Apocalypse that I showed you earlier, every time he gets those crit bleeds, look, look at the bleeds. Um, it will do damage equal to the last critical hit. That is insane. Just look at Winter Soldier's health melt away. Nuts, okay? Uh, I, I think this is one of the fastest uh, Winter Soldier kills that I've had. I, I, I absolutely love Apocalypse for this. Uh, in that video, you'll remember me saying, if you watched it, uh, that he was account changing. Well, this is what I was talking about. Now, everyone on the team could be made a horseman, but you can only do it once per quest. So now that Wolverine is a horseman and you see the horseman of apocalypse pop up there to the left, no one else can be a horseman. All right. So we're just going to go through some fights and we have some interesting fights coming up. Uh, the two fights that are probably of interest and I will make the little index. So on the progress bar, you can go right to the fights that you're interested in. Uh, but the interesting fights were Vision, Scarlet Witch, and Wolverine. Those three were the interesting fights, okay? Uh, but anytime I could bleed my opponent, they just got wrecked, okay? Now, Wolverine has a regen. When he's awakened, he has a regen. And uh, that regen is pretty powerful. Now, normally you want to fight Wolverine uh, keeping his power bar because the higher his power bar, the more potent the regen, okay? But we're just tearing through things. Look at his health, okay? So part of being a, a horseman of the apocalypse, the bleed that we start the fight off with because I'm running suicides, so that bleed is actually giving me health because I run uh, willpower, all right? So right now we're at the top, so you're not gonna be able to see uh, too much there, all right? And then he's got his regens. You see it's stacking. Anytime you see the regen stack twice, that's his regular regen and his regen from his uh, signature ability. That's how they stack. And that signature ability regen is nuts. But just look at this. We're, we're just ripping up this Juggernaut. Now, this Juggernaut in Realm of Legends is the old Juggernaut. 
meaning even when he's unstoppable, you can still stun him. All right, uh, the juggernaut that you probably face outside of Realm of Legends, you can't do that with. But this one remains unchanged. But just look at the critical bleeds. All right, I, I love this Wolverine. This is the Wolverine that I know and love, okay? Um, people often ask me, you know, who's my favorite character? And in all of the MCU, Hulk is my top favorite, followed by Wolverine and Spider-Man, okay? Now here, I just wanted to show you guys the uh, special three. Honestly, it's nothing special, okay? Uh, pardon that inadvertent uh, play on words there. Uh, but it's not the damage that that special two is right now. And just look at this, man. Just ripping up his opponents, all right? And you can see, you know, how many hits, but a lot of those bleeds are doing uh, the work for him. Now, you'll see what it looks like when he goes up against someone who's bleed immune, but if they can be bled and you have Apocalypse and Wolverine, you want to make Wolverine a, a horseman. Uh, we'll, we'll do some videos later if I rank up Cable to show just how powerful Cable is when he's a horseman, okay? Uh, fighting this uh, Rhino, you saw that 15K crit? Look at the damage. That's all because we got that high 15K crit and critical bleed, okay? Um, that's why I said that there might be a synergy that will produce more damage, but I'm running suicides and he's a horseman and he has the synergy with Apocalypse. So he is a beast. He's a beast now, man. Um, so we're gonna uh, continue on uh, going through, just ripping up our opponents. But again, if you want to skip ahead uh, to those fights, those fights were the ones that were, you know, pretty interesting to me. Um, this fight is uh, gonna be pretty straightforward. Uh, Storm, you have to watch out for her um, special attacks. She will one-shot you, okay? Uh, I remember when I first did Realm of Legends, uh, I think I got caught a couple of times by her uh, special attacks. And I, I think I also brought Wolverine in, but of course he wasn't the Wolverine that you're seeing here. Uh, so the fights took long. Uh, they were much longer than I liked. But the other thing that I want to mention with uh, Wolverine, uh, as a horseman especially, is that it felt safe fighting with him. Okay? Uh, I never felt in danger of dying. His health just kept going, you know, up. The fact that I'm firing off specials like crazy, even though I'm running suicides, is awesome. He is now suicide friendly. You know, because he had a regen, he was somewhat suicide friendly before, but now that regen is just insane. All right, next we are going to fight Vision. Now, this is one of the fights that I said was interesting. Uh, you're gonna see not great damage, but you'll at least get a chance to see what Wolverine can do when he's up against a bleed immune champion. All right, so don't worry, we are going to uh, speed it up, but I just wanted to show you, you know, kind of what it looked like here. All right. Get that fire, that special two. There we go. Uh, and that's pretty much how I do this fight. All right. Uh, so speeding it up so you don't have to sit through. It's a long fight. Uh, not as long as an Abyss fight or a Labyrinth of Legends fight, but a long fight. So what I basically did 
was I kept firing off those special twos. Those special twos, even though I wasn't getting, you know, the bleeds, they were still crit uh, critting. So I was still getting some damage, at least, you know, but not the ideal fight. Uh, I wanted to do this fight with Wolverine just to show you uh, what it was like. But normally, if I'm like doing a farming run in here, I'm going to pop open uh, or I'm going to use Wolf, uh, not Wolverine. I'm going to use Magneto for that fight. All right. So after that long fight, this fight is much, much better because he can be bled. Long as I can bleed him, they're going to die pretty quickly. All right. So, you know, you can see here, I'm just going in. You can see the bleed damage is pretty good. One of the synergies increases his bleed damage with uh, Omega Red, I believe. So take a look at the synergies, but uh, he's doing a lot of damage. Just look at that. Those special twos are just ripping folks up. Look at the health just melting away. And look at Wolverine's health. He is at 100%, despite the fact that I'm firing specials off here, you know, taking the recoil damage, but who cares? He's healing it back up. Insane. Loving it. 47 hits. And remember, the special two is like a three-hit combo. All right. This fight here, I was concerned with. And the reason I was concerned with this fight is because Scarlet Witch on crit has a chance to drain power. She also procs um, all kinds of nasty debuffs like poisons and heal blocks. There's a heal block up right now. So now I can't heal. So that is pretty much what I was worried about so what I decided to do here is to just go ahead and um, fight, try to get her down as quickly as possible. You can see I keep getting the heal block. I have three stacks of regen that would have taken me to full health, but she was just hitting me with the heal block. Now, I could also have slow played this fight. I could have um, waited until I had the, you know, regen and waited the heal block out and got some regen that way. Um, also the, um, when she puts a poison on me or she puts that weakness on me, I heal up from willpower as well. So I could have done that, but I wanted to get this fight done because I was figuring I could heal up in the next fights. So it wasn't as critical to end this fight with a full health bar. Um, I was kind of annoyed there because I was just about to light her up and I got my power drained. Uh, so that was uh, annoying with this fight, but we got her down. We definitely uh, are the worst for wear, but this is Wolverine and he's a horseman. So he's gonna heal up, all right? Now, this fight is the fight that I really wanted to see if I could take down Wolverine with Horsemen of Apocalypse Wolverine. And you're gonna see this fight. It's gonna be a, a, a seesaw battle. And I'm gonna change up my strategy somewhere in the, I don't know, I, I wanna say the middle, but I wanted to test out how much damage and there is luck involved here okay that regen i don't have despair maxed out that's another thing so first here i'm not trying to get him down i have a max power bar and i'm trying to heal back up from the previous fight okay uh now what you saw right there was also something new you saw that i went unstoppable i got hit and went unstoppable. That's one of the uh, abilities, I believe, of the horseman, uh, or it might be his synergy, but that's something that Apocalypse 
gives him, either through the synergy or because he's a horseman. All right, so now my health is almost back up to full. So it's time to see if I can actually get him down, okay? So getting clipped, I don't care. Um, and I just keep seeing that health bar go up. So I'm like, all right, I wanna see if I can get him some good special twos and if they will override his regen because the despair mastery, as you put debuffs, it actually slows down their regen, okay? Um, but I don't have despair maxed out. So I'm not getting the full uh, effect, but I am putting a lot of bleeds. But as you can see here, you know, he sometimes turtles up a little bit gets passive on me and he's back up to full so i'm thinking now all right what can i do all right there we've got uh the uh, special two off and he is losing health okay but he had gotten that regen prop all right so you see here i keep getting clipped there because i'm looking at the bleed and i'm looking for the proc of the regen so you can see i'm trying to let the bleeds do the work but here, as soon as I hit him, he procked. Now he's got two stacks on him. And he's you see how he's dashing back and, you know, playing a little bit more passively. I'm just like, man. All right, so got another special two off. And I'm like, all right, this is working. We've got like eight, seven, eight bleeds on him. Uh, and we have to keep those bleeds up. But sometimes he's passive. You see how I was just waiting out the bleed? Now, at this point... What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to let him hit into my block so I can build up power. And I'm just like, okay, I see what needs to happen. So I'm getting hit actually on purpose because I'm getting more power that way and Wolverine heals up. So you see there, I, I waited till I had the special two and I'm just like, okay, come on. We gotta um, be more aggressive. We gotta keep those um, bleeds on him I don't mind getting clipped like this, and uh, this will help us get to our special two a little bit faster. I got a little nervous there when I got stunned because I'm like, oh, wait a minute. I could get stun locked. Okay. Uh, don't want that. So here we are. We were close before, but I'm thinking, all right, we can't just go at this uh, willy nilly. Uh, we've got to play smart. Uh, I'm watching the regen, he's got one stack. And uh, I'm just waiting it out. We've got four stacks bleed. They're, they're going off. All right. And see, I'm, I'm blocking those because I'm a little bit low in health here. Try to heavy. And he procs a regen. And I'm just like, okay. So now he's getting all the way back up. And you see I'm getting hit. Uh, and I'm just like, okay, let's get this again. Look at all those bleeds. Let's go ahead and uh, try to get aggressive again. All right. We got hit again. Doesn't matter. Uh, all part of the strategy. I know it seems hard to believe it, but it's all part of the strategy. All right. Um, he only has one regen right now. So you see, I'm trying to wait that out, letting that bleed. Got the special two. We only got one regen. All right. So I'm hitting him again, but you see, I'm just tapping him once, trying to let it bleed down. And I'm just hoping that I don't get uh, another regen. But whoop, we got another regen. And that's why I did a full five hit to put more bleeds on him so that I could slow that regen down. Okay, so we've got a lot of bleeds. He's procking three regens, but it's okay. I got hit again, but I'm down, and I got uh, my special two ready. All right, so here we go, and we're just letting it go. Just letting it tick away, and we are uh, in assassin range. So we're doing a lot more damage. You see how I just tapped it twice so that the bleeds could do most of the work. All right, so here we go, 5%. Tap, didn't get a, a regen. Letting it go down, let it go down a little bit. Let that bleed just do its work. And it's doing some work. All right, 2%. We're gonna try and do it again. And maybe we can finish him off here. Boom, and he's down. And we got Wolverine down. This is a bottleneck for a lot of people. If you don't bring someone in here that can handle that regen, that's where you stop. You know, you don't go past go. You do not collect $200. All right. Uh, for those of you who play Monopoly, that's a Monopoly reference. Okay. Anyway, so those were really the exciting fights. That Wolverine fight, 
I had to actually use some strategy and get a little bit of luck because I wasn't getting the procs. If I had gotten the procs, I would have tried to just gone uh, more aggressive to put more bleeds to counteract. Uh, if I had despair maxed out, it would have gone uh, even better uh, because max despair, putting all those bleeds, we would have been able to handle uh, that regen and basically slowed it down to a crawl. Um, but even with one despair, you can see how effective that was. All right, so this fight is uh, me basically doing what I did before at the beginning of the Wolverine fight. I want to try to, you know, get some health up. All right, kind of slipped up there. I didn't want to block that because, of course, that, you know, still does a little bit of damage. But here we go. We, we're healing up. And I'm like, you know, that next fight shouldn't be too bad. But, you know, I like to play it safe. Not a big risk taker. Risk adverse, as they would say. All right. And so I'm just trying to heal up as much as possible. All right. Um, but I think at this point, yeah, I just went ahead and, and let that tick down. And we healed up as much as we could. All right. So... So far, Wolverine has handled every fight in Realm of Legends, including that Wolverine fight. That's the fight that I really was worried about. You know, Scarlet Witch was a concern, but that Wolverine fight was a big concern. All right, so final fight in Realm of Legends. We're going to be fighting my boy, the Hulk. I wish they would uh, rework him. Uh, he is my favorite character. He's who I was thinking of fighting with when I first joined Marvel Contest of Champions. All right. Um, and he's gotten an update before, but it did not do a whole lot for him. And I would love to see OG Hulk, but I don't think I will. Uh, they brought in another version of Hulk, uh, Gladiator Hulk. Then they brought in another version, which was Immortal uh, Hulk. And so, yeah, this Hulk may not see any reworks. But he still remains my favorite, you know, in the MCU, just not in this game. All right, but that is going to do it for this video, guys. That was Wolverine going through all of Realm of Legends as a horseman of the apocalypse. So take care, click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all... Have a blessed day.